chia seed pudding parfait. Ooh, wow. Yes. Johnny. Oh, yeah, we're going to layer the love. That's right. I've got a fun way to layer it up. I'm going to show you in a second. But first, let's work with the chia seeds now. Katie, I know you're proud of me. I love chia, chia seeds. seeds. So healthy, so good for you. Omegas. Yeah, good Fiber for your alert. gut. Mm -hmm. So you can get them at any grocery store now. I think like maybe 10, 15 years ago, you had to search hard. But you can get these in a bag usually. And this is a, a few tablespoons of chia seed here. I'm going to sweeten it up with a little bit of honey. Uh, you'll notice it pours well because I just zapped it a little bit. So, so I don't have that knot of honey yeah. moving around. Um, you're just gonna move this around. Mm. And Jeff, you've got Yo. some hazelnuts there and some of those banana chips that are kind of lightly salted you can find sometimes at the checkout. Just chop those together, put them okay. back in the bowl. That's gonna be the topping. Let me get my oat milk out of the refrigerator. Okay, it's a good combo. I like this. Oh yeah, it's super rich and creamy. I love it. It's delicious. It's gonna make everything nice and velvety when the pudding comes together. Just measure out the right amount. It's really cool when you just let it bloom on its own and it doesn't take long, just a couple of hours. Whisk it together. So that's the honey, the oat milk, and the chia? That's all you need to make this pudding. It's unbelievable and you feel like it's a guilty pleasure, you know what I mean? Yeah, that chia is like kind of this magical thing. It just opens up when it hits that liquid and gets super creamy. Yeah. I oh, look love at that. Look at that. That's I love crazy. the crunch in your teeth when you eat the chia seeds. Oh, it's mm -hmm. like a nice poppy seed pop. Do you know what I'm saying? Yeah. And actually, I think the first time I had chia seeds on a salad, I thought it was poppy seeds. And I'd even mentioned it to you, and you're like, no, those were chia seeds. And so I just love the fact that they bloom like they do. They create a nice gelatinous pudding for you. Um, if you do this and you feel like the pudding's a little bit too tight, just a little bit more oat milk to loosen it up. But this is perfection right here. Mm. Let me get a spoon out so you can see. Oh, when I grew up, Chia seeds were not little thing. You water and they grow. You remember yeah, that? Yeah, look at right. that. Okay, so I'm gonna make the levels of the parfait because that's what we're gonna do here. Um, very simple, so many different flavors if you want, but I've just got one banana that's been frozen. Ooh. You just kind of mash it up. I'm just gonna break it up oh, look and at that. help it out. And I then... I always have overripe bananas in my freezer. Yeah, always. I mean, anytime so a banana smoothies. starts going ripe, I just get it out of the peel, mash it flat, put it in the freezer, and it's good for smoothies and our parfait. On top of that, you guys have seen this two ingredient kind of ice cream, if you mm -hmm. will. You take the frozen banana, a little chocolate hazelnut spread, oh, blitz it up yum. until it's smooth. You good, Jeff? I wish I had one of those about now. <laughs> I could have put the nuts in. I'm like, oh my God, look at the veins in my forearm, bro. <laughs> oh, I I'm vascular. But look how easy it comes together. No, this is right? going to be good. I love the banana hazelnut combo, too. It's going to be good with that chocolate. It really is. And then, I mean, we're at the finish line. You're just going to take your cup, and I like to start with a layer of that sweetened by the honey chia Ooh, la, pudding. La. That rich and creamy oat Ooh. milk. And then I'm gonna go in and scoop out some of our luscious. Oh, I'm making banana. one of these with you, okay? Yum. Chia first. Yeah, it's so good. It's perfect on like a hot summer day. And I gotta tell you, sometimes I have this for breakfast or for dessert at dinner, and both times it feels indulgent and so wrong, but right. Here you go. That's your middle layer. Oh, look at this bananas. And then and a little bit more of that chia pudding over the top. I like the way it's hidden. And then, you know, Alex, you mentioned that pop of the chia seed. I love it too, but you know, I'm also team texture. So I like to come in there with some of your nuts and Beautiful. that banana. Salty, sweet. I I'm honestly, the banana, the hazelnut, the crunch of the seeds. Yeah? Yeah. Is it right up your alley? Yeah. And there you have it, really easy, my chia seed parfait. Oh. Stick a spoon in it and you're done. Here you go, Jeff. Oh man, I get the official Give a taste. taste. Oh, yeah. Thank you. Wow. Don't mind if I do. GZ. Thank you. For you. Tastes like dessert, doesn't oh. it? It's almost oh, like no. a, you know when you eat like a peanut butter banana sandwich that has that it has mm. that vibe, but mm. it's so cooling and refreshing. It really is.